Soggy fruit cocktails and mushy vegetables are things of the past in this school cafeteria. They're being replaced by fresh pineapple slices and crisp salads. Would, would you ever think you would see this in a cafeteria? With the help of a local chef, these lunch ladies and the meals they prepare are getting a gourmet makeover. Some 40 Denver cafeteria workers have spent the past three weeks baking, chopping, and working on their presentation skills for even the pickiest eaters. What we're shooting for again is to get below the white. The boot camp is part of a nationwide effort to tackle childhood obesity. I see kids coming to school with sack lunches, and I take a peek out there and I look in some of them, and they're bringing munchables and, I mean, I'm like, and little bags of Doritos or, you know, the little bags of Lay's, and I'm thinking, how is that, how are we less nutritious than that? But after all the intensive training, cafeteria workers say they understand it's not only about what they serve, but how they make it. Professional chefs are encouraging the lunchroom staff to steam fresh vegetables instead of reaching for the nearest can of corn or beans. They're also pushing them to get creative. It's all about appeal. The kids won't take just the red apples by themselves, but if I put a red apple with a green apple and maybe an orange, so they're all, they all fit together the way that we slice them, you know, it's a half of a fruit. They would take that. The new techniques will take a little more time than chicken nuggets, but the Denver trainees say it's a positive change. It's gonna be better product for the kids. You're making it with love, you're making it homemade, just like your mom would at home. To complete the makeover, all 600 or so cafeteria workers have been given new white chef coats and caps to replace their aprons and hairnets. And city officials say anyone who joins a school kitchen staff will be given basic knife training. Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.